Hello, friends and fellow farmers. We are back. Now, as I was thinking, during my big sleep that I just had, oh, I was thinking maybe I will get my hoe upgraded instead of my um, my battle axe, my uh, watering can. Just because... Uh, where did I keep... Oh, they are here. Um, might be a good use of the funds now instead of later, because I feel like I'm going to be broke soon. What with the impending child <laughs> that I'm going to inevitably end up having. Um, anything else here? No. Okay. Yeah. No. I don't. I don't quite know. Um. Oh no! You guys can come out if you want. Oh, hello. No. 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 Yeah. No, no. You know what? Do you? Okay, so age three months. With the whole heart situation, am I supposed to be like, am I earning hearts with the animals by like getting, petting them? I have no idea. I really don't. I mean, I just do that because I enjoy saying hi to the animals. But I'm wondering if that's actually part of the game, is that I'm, I'm supposed to, like, you know, earn hearts. Let's see. No, see, Nibbler doesn't have any hearts. I don't know. Okay. A large one. Oh. Does it increase their probability for producing really good crops? Again... Oh my gosh, I know what I should be spending my money on now that I've got my mega thing. We should be getting a goat and the other animal that they have. Sheep? Is it sheep? I think it's sheep. Those are not going to be cheap. Hmm. This is... We're hitting a hard point here. There's just, like, simply too many cool things for us to... Uh, to focus on. I don't know what, what's the best solution. Huh. Okay. Well. Now, do I need 10 bars of gold? I think I need 10 bars of gold. Yeah, so I don't even have enough gold yet. So, okay, let's, let's forget about that for the moment. We're going to, uh, no, no. Let's not do that. Let's turn around and do it the other direction. Oh my gosh, I really had to over, like overthink that for a minute. I was like, what have I done? Uh, now, does Harvey still want... Now Harvey doesn't even want the fish. I'm so sorry, Harvey. Go put that back in the fridge, because goodness knows it's disgusting having a rotting sunfish in your pocket. The ice cream is bad enough, but the ice cream and the fish are starting to mingle. It's not pleasant. All right, let's check out the uh, the crop situation here because if i've got to like toast up some gold you know the least least i can do is get some crops going whoa yeah we got a lot of things here okay are these are these ready they are ready oh gosh wow look at that oh oh my gosh Those look like something. Those aren't ready to be picked yet. What is this? Is are you? No, you're not ready. Oh my goodness! All right, let's. Whoa! I should go grab my uh, my metal rod. Come outside here. For some melons. Oh, there's more. Oh my gosh. Have I just run out? I, yeah, I think I. I can't get there. Everything's too magnificent. Oh wow. Okay. Well, uh, 
I'm going to make a few more seeds. And we'll throw those down. Okay. What you know what I should do is just hoe this first. I really got to get better on the, uh, whatever you call that stuff, fertilizer. <laughs> oh, you know, them farm words. Them farm words. It's like them big city words. Nobody ever accuses farm people of that. There's always the stereotype of, uh, you know, good hardworking people making fun of the city folk because they're big city words or they're, they're book learning. But nobody makes fun of farmers for their, oh, you and your technical agricultural terms that you learned at technical trade university. Oh, you and your smart farming. You're smart farming. Farmers, they, they, I, I don't think I could do farming. I think farming seems to be horrifically complicated. It really does. And the amount of hard work you'd have to do. Like, I, I do seem dedicated in my virtual world here. But in the real world, let me tell you, I do not have what it takes to be a farmer uh, full-time. I've been around enough farms to know that, uh, no, no, it's not the life for me. Is there, uh, is that not? No, real farming is, uh, is beyond me. I, it's... It's got to be one of those jobs where you're like, that's even you think, oh, they got all this time off in the winter. No, they're like, they're still putting in 12 hour days fixing things because <laughs> farmers are crazy and are, are always working. It's bananas. Oh my gosh. No, no. Look at this bounty. Wow. Oh, tomorrow we're going to have some money. We are going to have some money. Okay, I'm going to chuck a few of those in. Oh, that's that's good. the good cheese. I don't know what that means. Now, did we give all of the pears we needed to? That was... that lit up. We're going to have ourselves some uh, battery packs. All right, we got the animal stuff, right? I think we must have. Yeah, no, we must have. We we did the good crops bundle. Okay. Yeah, so I'm not I'm not concerned about giving away. But you know what? I do kind of like to keep some of the the top notch stuff here. Um. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of that. I don't. Oh, there was a recipe. There was some kind of... Okay, I'm, I'm such a pack rat. Hey, Timothy. Let's go down and see uh, Marnie and we'll see if we can buy ourselves um, some animals. Oh, for Pete's sake, the trees are growing in. I have to go murder saplings again. Problem is, I gotta go find Marnie during her three hours of work. That she does. Uh oh. Oh, that's bananas. Hey, fancy seeing you here. Oh, James, it's perfect timing that you showed up. Really? Because it's pouring rain, dude. I brought the children on a little field trip into the countryside. You know all about life in the country, right? So I was thinking, could you be my guest speaker today? Uh, no, no, I'd love to. I'd love to. I'd love to. Let me just call the children over. Chaz, Vincent, may I have your attention, please? I have a very special guest here to talk to you today. Our own very local farmer, James. He has first-hand experience living in the countryside, so he knows all about the valley's natural resources. What's well, ironic, I was just saying, not knowing anything about farms. Can anyone tell me what a natural resource is? Love. Love is a natural resource. Jazz? A natural resource is a material source of wealth that occurs in a natural state and has economic value. <laughs> Thank you, Jazz. That's a really cute animation they did on Jazz. That I've never really noticed that. Very good. Very good. Very good. That's worth two star points, Jazz. Yes! Okay, now let's give James our full attention. All right, we're gonna talk about kids. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Well, I'm going to say it's all about farming. Whoa, the valley soil is ideal for growing delicious vegetables. Yeah, well, it is. Yeah, you got a question, kid? Yes, Vincent? I'm Farmer James. If I eat our veggies, will I grow up to be strong like my big brother Sam? He's so strong, I saw him lift Miss Penny clear off the ground last night when they were climbing into a tree. <gasps> oh, oh. Uh oh. Vincent, it's not good to gossip. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, that's probably enough for today. You two run along and play. Are you breaking my heart, Penny? Is that what's happening here? Are you breaking my heart? Don't break my heart. It's a lot of work to take care of these kids, but I don't really mind. I enjoy seeing them learn, and hopefully I can help them grow up to be good people. Would you ever want to be a parent, James? Uh... <laughs> no, I think the world's crowded enough already. I mean, I've already got two kids, and... Oh, wait, did I, did I tell you about that? I have two kids. No, I don't want to be... I want to be a wild farmer living on the range. No, I don't think I'd be good at it. I, t I tend to drop things... And uh, I've dropped a lot of babies. I mean, there's a reason I had to leave my previous place is uh, all the broken babies I left. Uh, I don't know if I want to say, uh, do I want a big family? I haven't really thought about it. I don't know. I don't want to scare her, but I feel like I should say it. I want a big family. Me too. I'm glad you feel that way. Oh, whew, we, we dodged one there. Wow. Well, that was an awkward cutscene. So, uh, she's, she's playing the field. Well, I'm glad you showed up, James. I think the kids had a great time. I was a little afraid I was getting the blue screen of death there. Oh, wow. And that hardly took up. And I lost my... Where's my horse? Penny, what'd you do with my horse? Marnie. Glad you... Wow. You're here? Okay. Smell like grass, dude. I was just your your special guest speaker. Dare, how dare you talk to me like that? Okay, I'm gonna buy some animals. Yes. Oh, eight thousand G's for that one. Sixteen thousand G's for it. I can't even buy a pig. I can't even buy a pig. But you know where I'm putting you? I'm putting you in the big barn. You're going to live with the big. Oh no, that is not a name for a sheep. Hmm. Well, I know Zane wanted me to name a sheep Buddy. So Buddy is the name of the sheep. I think that's a good name. Great, I'll send little Buddy to her new home right away. Oh, it's a she too. Poor Buddy. I'm so sorry, Buddy. Uh, and I, I need to buy shears. That's a thousand bucks. Man, these, these animals are... I'm going to start my acquisition of uh, fodder now. Just so I don't accidentally run out. Anybody see any worms? Anybody got any worms? Do you got worms? Hey cow, do you got worms? No? Oh, I do like my forageometer is telling me that there's some stuff down here though. Oh, there's a frog I can... The, uh, oh, where is my forageometer leading me? Where, where did it say? Was it? Oh, it's behind the tree. Oh, that's, that's kind of nice. That's useful. Although, honestly, I'm probably going to spend more time going like, where, where, where? Okay, now can I? No, I can't get that. Hmm. Oh, island, what use are you to me when you do not have any of the food I require? Oh, hey, look at that. Boom. This is starting to get a little overpopulated with rocks and junk. I should probably clear that out. Uh, I should also... I was going to go give my friend the Dark Lord something nice. Hey, dude. How about you... You want one of these? Cool. I'm leaving you alone. I'm afraid of this stuff. I was going to offer him a haircut. 
be like, dude, I got some shears. Like I, I'm careful. I've, I don't have a collection of ears that's very large at all. Like it's, it's hard. You can barely even call it a collection. How about that? Oh, there is Timothy, dude. Now that sound is that? Is there a train coming through Stardew Valley? Out of my way. Or is it? No. Yeah. Let's see. What? What the heck? Because that uh, that sound is. Because uh, otherwise, when I hear the whole there is a train coming through, I I can never make it. Hey, Linus. Gotta see a guy about a train. No. Huh. Okay. Is there any worms here, though? Man, I really cleaned... Oh, there is some. There is some. See, this is what I'm talking about. That's it, right there. He found a lost book. So we go read that when we go to the library. Ridiculous. Like, I've gone the whole game so far without, like, n knowing what... Uh, it's so absurd. Like, I can scarcely believe I was... I can... The, the game allowed me to continue to play. The, the game should have just shut down and been like, you know what? You're not hoeing enough. Are you sure? Can you see a train, Timothy? Do you see? Do you see? Why don't we head into the... Do you, do you, there's just a blinding white light, you say. Well, that doesn't seem like anything. Well, I guess there was not a train coming. Hey, dude. What's going on? You look bummed. Okay, well, don't have that then. Right, I wanted to go to the uh, the adventure dudes and see how my murdering was going. Greetings. Hey, dude, I'm going to check the job board. Whoa, I got to kill a thousand slimes. I've only killed 350. But I'm doing good on bats. Look at that. Look at that. I've killed 189 cave insects. Oh, do you have rewards? Or are you Gil? Or is the other guy Gil? 25,000, eh? Yeah. Mm. Oh, I see. And that's how I got. Okay. Okay. This makes more sense now. Oh, hey, there's grapes right there. I'm not going to say no to some perfectly good ground grapes. Ooh, Ruby. That, is that a diamond up there? So, Timothy, I don't want to be rude, but you're going to have to find your way home on your own, okay? Because I got some mining to do here, buddy. Batteries are all filled up. Man, I love how not tired we get. I'm excited to see tomorrow how much uh, we're going to make from all the junk we threw in our uh, our box. I, it, ooh, hello. Where's my... Oh, right. I keep forgetting my... Because my axe is fancy. Whoa. I'm, I've got to try that out more. So I'm just going to go for a little stroll here, Timothy. Timothy's a smart, he's a smart horse. He'll make it home. Got to try out the golden axe. Oh, good. Speaking of gold. Um, you and you. Did I not grab the... Oh, no. oh. <laughs> how about I try and throw the, the gold in and not the coal? Perfect, okay. Wow. Yeah, we had a good haul. And you... 
Excellent. Now let's go see what this kind of damage this gold da axe can do. Nothing. I can't. I can't chop down anything. All right. There we go. Let's thin this out here. I'm pretty sure that's last effort. So it's six hits now. I don't know what it was before. I want to say seven, but I don't know. No matter what, I'm definitely conserving energy. This is good. Wow. Yeah, this is actually, this is nice, because I'm able to, uh... I'm gonna let all these little trees grow in. Oh, good. A bat. Oh, man. Yeah, the other thing, I didn't realize it could block. That was another thing I didn't even, I had no idea. Like... I, you know, I think if, if you need any kind of uh, reassurance that I, I really don't um, know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just like, really? Really? Have I, have I been playing it that wrong? Really? Oh my gosh, I have. I can't believe I have, I need that... I wonder if that's part of the deal with, like, needing to, um, get slimes on my property here. Why it's good to be, like, a monster hunter. Not just because it sounds cool on our resume, but because it's, like, legitimately useful. I don't know if it keeps adding more bait or if I just need to, um... continually, uh, if I need to get it out of there so that more stuff will work. I have no idea. I don't know how that works. Alright. Um, oh, excellent. Oh, and I had some. Wow. Oh, I've got, I, yeah, I gotta put that fodder in the bin, don't I? Why am I walking around with the whole pile of fodder sticking out of my... Oh, no, I... It's like you've eaten the raw hops and now you're vomiting everywhere. All right. Oh, how'd you get out of the way? Get out of the way. Ah, ah, dude, 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 dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's the stuff that panics me. All right, we're going to take a break here. Next time we'll come back and see the continuing saga of Penny and Love. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.